do my skincare with me or whatever you want to call it right i'm just going in with my ordinary serum and guys the amount of bugs i've seen this week is actually just not even funny i feel like i'm on i'm a celebrity like where's ant and deck they could literally hire me like the amount of bugs that i've killed this week i'm a boss i am literally a boss i could literally be on i'm a celebrity i literally can't handle school anymore like i'm actually so bored of it i literally fell asleep about 20 times today and i got told about 50 times to run my skirt down it's actually so bad right i don't know what i'm supposed to do yet because i'm going to this boy's house tomorrow and like my makeup after school it literally looks horrendous like it just doesn't last at all like i only put contour on and somewhere else today and it literally just phew, sweat off like i don't even know what happened to it but i don't know whether i should just not wear any makeup or because i just can't get my makeup to last at all it just doesn't last okay can't lie to you i started this getting me like three hours ago two hours ago it's literally half past nine now i completely forgot to finish it because i went for my dinner but i'm gonna finish it I'm actually dreading tomorrow because I don't know what to do. I don't know whether to put makeup on or not to go to that boy's house. But like, because I don't really want to look like this because it's just not the vibe. I think I'm just going to do my makeup at his, bring my makeup back to school with me because what's the point in me doing my makeup tomorrow morning? It turning out shocking and me looking a mess to go to his because I'll literally cry. So yeah, I'll probably just do my skincare tomorrow, I don't know, but yeah. Right, and I'm going to spray some more of this. I literally have an obsession with spraying this. And like, last but not least, I'm just going to put my serums on. So my eyebrow and my eyelash serum. This song just reminds me of like December, October, November, something like that last year. Um, I finished now. I'm going to bed. Get ready me for school. Okay, obviously very much so. Do not want to go right now. And I have um an away tennis match, which means I'm not gonna get home till like seven. I just hate school so much. I think I decided that like odd days are the day with my worst schedule. I don't know, I couldn't decide which one I didn't like, but I think this one I don't like. I think just because this day I have pre calc and health and I don't know. This weekend went by so fast, which is so depressing. But I think it's just because I did nothing Saturday and then I did something Sunday. So it melt made Sunday feel like Saturday because I like never do things on Sunday. Because like, I did something Friday and s I don't know. I have to figure out how much makeup I want to start wearing to school because I did like a full face for a picture day in the first day because like those are really important. But I just know like I am not about to be doing a full face every single day. So I have to figure out like the sweet spot. Like I feel like last year by like the end of the year I didn't even wear makeup. But it's only the third day of school so we're not there yet. I'm using the Persona like Dream Stick Stick Blush in Guava. I'm taking the bus today for the first time this year and I really don't want to. Okay, I also need to figure out what time I want to wake up in the morning because last year, I woke up at like 6.40, which is the time right now. Oh my god. This year, I woke up at 6 for the two days last week. And then today, I woke up at like 6.15, like 6.20-ish. And like, that feels good. Because like, I wake up, I get dressed, I go downstairs, I get my iced tea, and then I brush my teeth, and then do my makeup. And then I'm done with my makeup by like 6.50 ish and I pack my bag and then go downstairs and eat breakfast and then I walk to the bus. It's so like I think 6.15 feels like a good time. But it's also like I do want to get some extra sleep but like how big of a difference does 20 minutes really make? I want some lip gloss and we're ready for school. I don't want to go. How am I already dreading school this early in the year? Okay, bye guys. Okay, bye guys. Get ready with me for the fifth day of high school. Okay, first I'm going to straighten my hair and then I'll be back. Okay, I'm back and I got a haircut yesterday, so my hair is shorter and I think it looks better straight like this because I don't know. Okay, so y'all told me to wet my face, so I'm gonna wet my face before I put on my hyaluronic acid. Okay, so school yesterday was really good. Um, we did like a quiz in math and it was like a review and i got a 25 on it but like it's okay because it is a grade but we can redo as many times as we want to get 100 by like sunday also i have the cutest outfit for today um i'll show you all at the end of the video 
but my new Bounce 550s came in and, and they're so cute. I'm like in love with them. Also, some people are asking what this is and it is the Tula sunscreen. It's that one. I got it at Ulta. But hopefully I don't get dress coded. I don't think I will because like it like doesn't show my stomach. Like it shows like literally a centimeter. But I'm scared that a teacher's gonna make me put my arms up because um they have to do that sometimes. But yesterday in cheer we had a sub, so it was like really really easy because our cheer coaches had to go with the varsity team to um, the away game and it was like two and a half hours away. My next game is next Wednesday or Thursday and I can make like a get ready with me um, at school so I can maybe do that if y'all want. Also, thank you everyone for um, being so nice in the comments. I'm trying to like reply to every single one, but like it's really hard because like it's just hard. Also, this mascara is the Voluminous Butterfly Waterproof Hydrophobic and it like doesn't have a brand on it, but it looks like that. And if you look up Butterfly Mascara on Amazon, then you should find it. Okay, now for the little eyebrow tutorial. I used the e.l.f. brow lift because some people ask for eyebrow tutorial. Um, first, I like shape my eyebrows, and I could do another video on that because I think that's mostly why my eyebrows look the way I do. But I take it, and like I have this spoolie from e.l.f. that is broken and bent. I like it bent. And I just like brush my eyebrows up in the front, and I like curve. You see? So I like... Just like that. And then also the Gucci blush. It's in shade 03 Radiant Pink. And it looks like that. Because someone asked what shade. Okay, now I'm gonna go get dressed. Okay guys, so this is my outfit. Jeans from PacSun. Shirt from my sister's closet. Um, shoes, New Balance 550s, and y'all, these shoes are so cute. I'm like obsessed with them. Next for jewelry, I got Kendra Scott, um, Altered State, Claire's, Kendra Scott, Kendra Scott, and Pure Vita. Okay, then for my lips, I use the lip liner and lip oil. So de Janeiro, then the Billie Eilish. Okay, that's it. Bye! Get on ready with me the night before my birthday. I really am sorry, not sorry about all the birthday content that's come because I've already mentioned it in the past. Every single video I've posted on this account. But this can only start yesterday, so that's why it's been mentioned so much. But yeah, there's a lot going on this week. Because it's my 18th, I have like a lot of different birthday celebrations going on. So it's going to be a lot of TikToks and if you don't like it, deal with it jokes but in all seriousness if you do like all birthday content and stuff make sure you're following me because there's a lot coming including on my instagram and youtube which i believe are both linked i think my youtube's linked don't know if my instagram is but it will be on there too i've literally been banished to my bedroom now it's half eight i'm not allowed to come down so i think i have to watch love island final on my own in bed which is a little bit sad <laughs> but it's all be worth it tomorrow because my mum and sister are I don't know what they're doing downstairs, um, but I might be able to come watch you downstairs if everything's not set up. I am so excited because I'm having a spa day tomorrow, which is my actual birthday, and I have my party this weekend, so like I have so much going on, and then I'm going out for food tomorrow night with my dad's side of the family, and then I have my birthday with my boyfriend on Friday because he's not actually here at the minute, so like... There's so many celebrations going on, this is literally a birthday week, so you're going to receive birthday content until Sunday. Sorry, not sorry. I am going to do a proper cleanse and like a bit of a... Just dropped it. A bit of um, a skincare routine after this, um, but I'm going to take my makeup with a wipe. Basically for the sake of these videos, whenever I do an Unready With Me and take it off the wipe, I don't actually do this every day. 
but I will do a cleanse in there because I'm gonna have a shower, have a shave, like some of the spice, like shave my legs and stuff. So I need to do all that. The girly malarkey. And then I have new birthday pajamas, which is a tradition in my family. So I'll be putting them on. Does anybody else have birthday traditions? Because obviously like Christmas traditions are a thing. But does anyone else have birthday traditions? Like we always get new pajamas. And it's just like a thing on our birthdays. If you do, let me know in the comments because I'm actually I don't know if that just caught me off because my tits I did that thing where like you've been on it for too long. Um but if you do have traditions, actually let me know in the comments because I'm really intrigued by it. I told my hairdresser I wanted blonde and it's safe to say that most definitely happened. I have got highlights by the way, hence why it's stripey. It's not like a full head of dye. I mean the lighting's not doing it justice, but this is the first time I'm seeing it up with my new colour in. Let me know in the comments oh I'm dry if you wanna see your birthday get ready with me in the morning. Um yeah, I'm kind of spotty, so I don't really be doing much makeup, but I've been a little get ready me, so let me know if you want to see that, and yeah. Just whack my elbow, I don't know if you saw that, but that hurt. Hey guys, and get ready with me for Beyonce. That is something I did not think I'd be saying today, because these tickets were so last minute. Like... We got them like two days ago and my mom tried to surprise me so she got them two days ago and told me yesterday so we just like went shopping today and put out some sparkly outfit i made way too much my fit are some cargo pants and this as my top and then i'm gonna put sunglasses on and jewelry so wait till the end for my jewelry and sunglasses it's all silver and i'm a gold girl like all my jewelry is gold so you know so i got i'm using my mom's bracelet that i'll show you guys at the end and then some jewelry from target so it's beyonce so obviously i'm gonna go like my all out isn't too all out but like we're gonna do like what more than i normally do my mom's listening to some beyonce right now so I'm going to tell you the story of how we ended up with these to Beyonce. So my friend's mom posted on her story that she was selling these tickets. So like immediately I just texted my mom and was like, oh my god, we have to go. But like I assumed that they were like $200 tickets and that it was just like Beyonce. So like, like I had no clue Beyonce was performing in Boston. Like what? So then my mom texts my mom's friend and then was like... So then I called my mom and I asked her how much they were and then she tells me that they're 500 and that we can't get them So I was like disappointed, but I was like, okay with it because that's a lot of money and I had no clue They were that much. So then whenever my mom said no and I was like, okay with it guys I'm even gonna put some contour there and here like this is all out to me But then um, I came back from my race because that's why I was like texting her with all this info because I wasn't with her. Also, the funny thing is I had literally already made a playlist because I was like so sure we would go. Guys, I forgot to snatch my jawline for Beyonce. This is so fun. I even got a high ball. Anyway, back to that. Um, so then I was just like chilling in my room and then she comes up to me and is like, we're going to Beyonce. So obviously I was like so thrilled. Then we woke up this morning and had to go get like our little fits. It took us like three hours in the mall but we also did stop for starbucks and stuff but check out that video on my page because my mom was like you should do a little shopping vlog and i was like good idea we're gonna add a little bit more dior blush i love this brush i literally got it off sheen it's the best blush brush ever then we're gonna do this some highlighter white liner then some setting spray i'm gonna clip the hair then i'm gonna be using my mom's bracelet I got this little ring, but I have super fat fingers, so it's only going to fit on my pinky, but it's okay. And this earring pack, but Target gave me a broken ear. I'm sad because I was planning on wearing those, so now it's up to these ones or these ones. Oh my goodness, I've never worn hoops this big, so these ones or these ones. I'm feeling these bigger ones. No necklace because my top is kind of like enough. But this 